My name is Ebony Slaughter Johnson. I'm a Next Leaders intern and I'm working with uh, Karen Dolan on the Criminalization of Poverty Project. We're currently working on a project that looks at the um, school to prison pipeline, uh, which is the process by which um, school or students get uh, funneled um, into the um, into juvenile. Um, and to the juvenile justice system through uh, harsh uh, disciplinary policies imposed upon them uh, um, as students uh, in their schools. And so yeah, we're, we're looking at that, at that phenomenon from a variety of different perspectives um, in terms of like um, the disparate effect on um, African American girls of color, uh, the disparate effect on um, LGBT students and um, things like that. I was originally attracted to the Criminalization of Poverty Project because I um, studied uh, African American history in college. And I, so I, I, I was interested in how, you know, African Americans had been uh, criminalized by, you know, the state uh, broadly. Um, in the past, uh, but I wanted to know how African Americans and you know poor people of color more broadly were being uh, criminalized uh, in the present. IPS's work uh, goes to support uh, social justice movements, and I thought that mandate uh, was really impressive and uh, something that I wanted to be a part of. I think that IPS is different from the other nonprofits that I've worked with in that its internship program is truly an enrichment program for interns. IPS has gone above and beyond in terms of allowing its interns to um, really contribute to projects. I know I've personally been able to do, uh, to take um, advantage of certain opportunities like writing and um, doing interviews and going to um, panel presentations and even participating in uh, some.